Okay, so for today's writing, you're going to be looking at number two. Okay, right there. And on your journal to begin, you're going to write like we would do in the morning during breakfast time. Today is Tuesday, and you write the letters that are missing for Tuesday. April, and then 14, you write the number that's missing there, the digit. 2020 period and then this is your topic for today so that you can write one of the best times of the day is when you get to sit down and have a meal like breakfast lunch or dinner what is the tastiest meal you've ever had how often would you have it if you had a choice what would happen if you tried cooking it yourself? Okay. So you're going to write the answers to all of the questions. And remember, if you go to Mesornela's ALP group, you can give more information. You can write another two sentences about it. Okay. And on the bottom of your paper in your writing journal, you're going to draw and color your picture like we do in the classroom. Okay. So for today, your writing is number two okay when you finish your work on your writing journal go to class dojo to the portfolios i will be putting up the assignments later and you can take the picture and send it to miss morales okay so now after our writing journal now we're going to be talking about the decodable for today Move this. Okay, so I'm going into benchmark. Okay, you see this screen? Raise your hand if you see the screen of benchmark. Okay, very good. Do I have anyone else? Oh, is someone waiting? Okay, give me a second because I think I have someone else waiting. Okay, so after you go here, you remember you click on the C. Okay, then you go to the four squares. Okay. okay. Then you do not have this screen. This is only for Ms. Morales. You will go to the other one. I will show you the other screen. Okay. Then you go to the assignments. Okay. And right here, this is like how you do it with Ms. Ornelas and Ms. Morales. You are going to look for unit eight, week one. So it's right here. Okay, that's your unit eight, week one. Okay, so this is what you're going to be looking for. And it has everything that you should be practicing this week and that we are going to be talking about. The decodables, Mark sees the stars and wish upon a star. And then the shared reading, Okay, that it's unit seven, unit eight, my shared readings. Okay, so right now we are going to start with the decodable.
Okay. So on the decoder ball, we used to do it already on the iPad, okay? But if you press here, it will give you the directions what to do. Read the story three times, circle the high frequency words, color code the word families, answer the comprehension questions from the picture, send me the picture through Class Dojo. Okay. Now here, okay, you would be, this one is to be turning the pages right here on the bottom. Now let me review the tools. And for your parents, let me explain to your parents if they're there. Okay. You can press here. R. Okay. High frequency words. And Boy. Then, city. Four. Great. Mark sees the stars. Okay. So you will be reading it. If you need help to read it, you will be need reading it with um with the audio and on the iPad or your telephone. Okay. Now it says to circle. Okay. Okay, raise your hand if you're seeing page two and three on the decodable. Okay, thank you. I just want to make sure we're on the same page. Okay, remember you press on the wrench for your tools. And right here, you will be using your pen and you can pick your color here, a different color for each word family, okay? So instead of using our crayons, we're going to be using this to circle your word families because Ms. Morales is going to be looking for this assignment on benchmark. Okay, so right here you have the arn, arc, and then r. Okay, so each box, like in the classroom, you will use a different color to box the word family. Then you go back to your book and you're going to be circling all of the words that belong to that word family with the same color. Okay. Now, today we're going to, you're going to be answering the comprehension questions. Okay. The comprehension questions, I send the picture on Class Dojo for your parents. Okay. That way you can answer the three questions. Okay. So I will be showing you the notebook. I know I sent the picture also yesterday for the word families and the questions. But I will be showing you at the end because right now I'm going on benchmark with the shared reading. Okay, so your shared reading is going to look like this. Okay, your purple book. And on this, the shared reading, you're going to be do, doing the same. Turning the pages like if you had your book. Here we have the table of contents, okay? So you're going to be looking for the shared reading for this week. And I also send a picture on Class Dojo. Okay. Raise your hand if you can see the shared book. Okay, so for today, okay, it says read the story three times. Number two, retell the key details to your parents. 
Number three, annotate your wow and your question. Okay. Answer the comprehension question in the journal and then send me the picture in Class Dojo in your portfolio. Okay. So, oh, it would so again, okay, we will read it here with Ms. Morales one time. Okay. And then we will do the annotating. But then when we are done, you will be going onto your iPad. And if not, you have a picture in Class Dojo. And you could just do the circling, everything that they're asking you to do, and then send me a picture. And you will do the work in your journal. So don't worry if you do not have the iPad to do it on the computer. You just do it on a paper from the picture that I sent, and you send it to Ms. Morales. A star party. party. It's, it's dark. dark. Can, Can we, we start? start? Carla, Carla asked. asked. Carla, Carla was, was having, having a star party with her friends, friends at the farm. farm. They, they would, would look at stars through, through mom's, mom's telescope. telescope. Yes, yeah, let's, let's go. go. Mom, Mom said, said, outside, far away, away from, from the city lights, Carla, Carla and her friends looked at the sky. They, they saw many stars. Then they looked through the telescope. telescope. One star was big and bright. Mom, Mom told them it was a planet, not a star. It, it was Mars. Mars. Let's, Let's call it a sky, sky party, party, Carla said. said. Okay. Circle a word that has the same op Okay, ready? So now let's go ahead and read it with Miss Morales. So it says, a star party. It's dark. Can we start? Carla asked. Carla was having a star party with her friends at the farm. They would look at the stars through mom's telescope. Yes, let's go, Mom said. Outside, far away from the city lights, Carla and her friends looked at the sky. They saw many stars. Then they looked through the telescope. One star was big and bright. Mom told them it was a planet, not a star. It was Mars. Let's call it a sky party, Carla said. Mm -hmm. So then here, no. R sound as Carla, okay. underline. A okay, so we're going to be circling the words that have the R sound as in Carla. So for that, you go to the wrench, Remember, you get the pen, you pick orange, is that orange? Thank you. orange, and now I'm going to circle all of the words that have the R sound like Carla. Okay, so star, party, dark, start, Carla, okay, star, party, okay, farm, Stars. Okay, so I those are it on this page. So you will be doing the same on this other page. And like I said, if you cannot do it on the iPad, on your mom's phone, your parents' phone, you just have the picture on Class Dojo. You make a list on a paper from this page, the ones Ms. Morales did, from this page that you're going to do independently. Okay, now let's go on to the next task. Okay, it's right there. 
So I press it here for a the four letter word that is the name for a place mm -hmm. where lots of people live all close, close together. together. Okay. Put a so now I go back to the wrench. I'm going to change the color to the purple. Okay. And it's a four letter word that is the, the name for a place where lots of people live all close together. Okay, so I'm going to look. And the four letter word that it's a place. Okay. There, and I underline it, okay? Mm -hmm. Now the last... Star next to an important detail from the story. Okay. A star party. Okay. So, okay, now I think which one is an important detail, okay, from the story. I change the color. One was the, it's purple. Oh, the other one was blue. Sorry. So, like this one, it was supposed to be blue. Ms. Morales did a mistake. So now I have to go get the eraser to erase it there. Okay, now I change it to blue because I did a mistake. There, now that's blue. Now I get my purple, okay, to look for my important detail. Okay, and I, one of the important details is they would look at the stars with their mom's telescope right there. That's an important detail. So this is how we used to do it in your book, but you don't have your book. So we're going to try our best to continue doing it with what we have. Okay, boys and girls. Now, my directions here. Let me close the wrench. Okay, it says, retell the key details about the text. What did Carla and her friends see in the sky? Okay, so this, the retelling, okay, it would be using the key details. And remember, the key details are important information in the story. Okay, so the important information in the story is, what would be an important key detail? Okay. Carla was having a star party. Okay. And the next one would be they would go, they would look at stars through their mom's telescope. Okay. And then they had to be outside the city lights. And then they saw one star, okay, that was big and bright, okay. And then, and the other important detail would be that the star, it's not really a star, it's a what? Planet, okay. So thumbs up if you understand up to here what you're going to do. Show me or raise your hand. Show me thumbs up or raise your hand. Okay, so after you get done with everything here, you have to press the arrow up here. You see the cloud with the arrow? You see where Ms. Morales is pointing on the top? Show me thumbs up if you see the cloud with the arrow. Okay, that's, that's where you are going to be saving, okay, your work. Okay, you press there the cloud, and then you go to done. Okay, now the annotating. Remember, your wow, okay? 
you have to think which one is your wow. If you're not going to do it here, you're going to do it on your piece of paper, then you would write the word wow right here, okay? Thumbs up if you can see it, okay? You would write your word wow, and then you would write your, your sentence. Like Miss Morales, wow is this one, okay? Mom told them it was a planet, not a star, okay? So I would be writing here, I go again to the wrench, I get my pen, I pick a different color, this one could be any other color that you want, and then right here, like we would do it in the classroom, okay? I would put my exclamation mark because that's Miss, that's, that's my wow right there, okay? Now a question, okay? That's your other annotating. What question do I have? Okay, right here. Where did mom buy, Look. buy the telescope? Okay, so that would be my question. And again, if you're going to do it on a paper, on a piece of paper, you write the question and you put your question mark, I mean, you write your, what, your sentence and you put a question mark, that way I know that's your question mark, okay? Now, right here, we tell the key details we did already and then what did Carla and her friends see in the sky? On a piece of paper, you're not going to do that here. You're going to do it on a paper. You're going to write the title of the story, okay? And then you're going to answer the question. And that I will show you right now on my iPad. Okay, so I'm going to stop sharing here. Okay, and I'm going to go, okay. So you have, your parents have the picture on Class Dojo for the decodable. Give me the questions, please. Okay. Then today, you would be answering the comprehension for Mark sees the stars, okay? And you will be answering in complete sentences, okay? Now, the writing journal. It's not here. It's on the bottom. Right here. On your paper for the decodable, okay, you would be having this, and I also send the picture to your parents, okay, on Class Dojo. So you're going to have your word family, and then on the bottom, you're going to answer the three comprehension questions, okay? Raise your hand if you understand what you're going to do with the decodable. Okay, so that will be the work for today. Now, okay, for the shared reading today, you're going to do it, you're writing, okay, what did Carla see in the sky? You're going to write the answer here. You write the title, today's date, 4 14, 20, okay? And then you answer in a complete sentence, and on the bottom, you're going to write I mean, you're going to draw and color your picture, okay? And like I said, if you do not have, um, if you're not going to do it on the internet, I also sent your parents the picture on Class Dojo, so you have the story there, okay? So you can do the right circle, your R words, and if you don't, cannot circle in them, then you're going to also write them here on the paper, your R words, okay? So all of the work for the start party, you will have it here, okay? If you do it on the computer on your iPad, it's fine, I will check it from there. If you do it on the paper, when you get done, then you send me a picture 